Erica Simone here from Color Their World. Welcome. Thank you so much for joining me today because you know what? It really is better when you're reading with me. It's just so much fun. So today we have a really good book. Well, I have a good book that I want to share with you. It's called Autistic. How silly is that? Mm, really? Let's find out how silly it is. So we're going to sit back, grab a snack. What snack are you having today? You know, I was thinking about getting chips and then I thought maybe I should get cookies because I always have chips and I should try something different. Or maybe I should do something healthy like carrots or cucumber. Let's just read. Autistic. How silly is that? Written by Linda Farrington Wilson. I don't need any labels at all. I have brown hair. I wonder if that makes me brown, hairtistic. Or if being left handed makes me self potistic. Cool. I can swim like a fish, so I guess that would make me aquatistic. Now that's just silly. If I catch a fish, am I fish artistic? And if I cook the fish, would that make me culinary artistic too? I love to eat donuts and jelly beans and ice cream. Does that make me junk food artistic or sugar craving artistic or just plain? Loves donuts, jelly beans, and ice cream tistic. I am really good at math, which I think would make me math tistic, but I'm not so good in history. So, would I also be historistic or quite possibly non historistic? My feet are, are sort of big and my teeth are not straight. So would I be considered Bigfoot orthodontistic? <laughs> Hysterical. I have autism. A part of me feels overloaded some of the time and social situations are awkward. And well, communicating is a bit of a challenge because my brain is just wired in its own way. Does that make me brown hairtistic, south potistic, aquatistic, fish artistic, culinary artistic, junk food artistic, sugar craven artistic, loves donuts, jelly beans, ice cream artistic, math artistic, historistic, bigfoot orthodontistic, and Autistic? Phew, ridiculous. I don't need any labels at all. I'm just a typical person with my own likes and dislikes, strengths and weaknesses, hopes and dreams, who approaches the world a little differently, but many times better. I'm a brilliant person with autism. Autistic. How silly is that? <laughs> I rock! Thank you so much for reading with me today. Don't forget to click the thumbs up button, comment if you can, and subscribe to the channel so you'll know when we're coming out with new content. Till we read again!